Hey, what's up you guys? This is Nayla Latrice and I am here to do a motivational Monday video. This is something new that I uh, have decided to start. It is kind of just freestyle. I am a motivational speaker and a life coach. Also, I am an intuitive reader and healer. So I am going to be starting a lot of new different videos on my channel besides just to roll an oracle. So, um, yeah, this is the first of many different videos. I'm just going to be, I guess, kind of pushing them out. Um, I am getting on a regular routine and schedule, so do bear with me. But this is something new that you guys can look forward to, okay? So, the message that I have received um, to share with you is, what are you afraid of? And taking that and running with it, I want to say that everybody has a purpose that they must fulfill. And I feel the energy that um, I just saw 1-1 one, one or 101. So there are definitely new beginnings and it's time to start new. And that is exactly on track <laughs> with this message. What are you afraid of? Why are you to start on this new path that you see right in, in, that you see right in front of you? There is a new pathway that has opened up for you. There is a new portal that has opened up for you. There are new opportunities that are here waiting for you. They are knocking at your door, but I feel that many of you are afraid to move your free. Uh, uh, many of you are, the messages are just coming so fast. Many of you are afraid to move your feet and move in the direction that you are being guided. It's not that you don't know. It's not that you don't have the tools. It's not that you don't uh, understand what it is that you are supposed to be doing. You are just stuck because of fear. And spirit is saying, fear does not live here. You have been divinely guided to this moment, to where you are in your life right now. So why are you afraid? Do you trust your spirit guides or not? Do you trust your ancestors or not? Do you trust God or not? Do you trust the universe or not? Do you trust the, the blessings and the purpose and the gifts, the spiritual gifts that has been placed upon you, placed within you to accept expressed outwardly to the world. Many of you claim and say that you trust this, but you really don't because you're not moving. You're just staying stuck. You're doing things to make it seem like you're busy when in actuality, you're not really being busy. You're busy doing nothing. And spirit is looking at you like, what are you doing? It's time to move forward and not stay stuck anymore. There is somebody out here that really needs what it is that you have to offer. That is why you were placed on this earth. And while you are here on this earth, you must fulfill that purpose. So again, Spirit is asking you, why are you scared? Um, I do believe that many of you guys have a... Uh, uh, a self-belief problem. You guys do not believe in yourself or you feel that you don't have everything that you need to move forward. And Spirit is saying you have everything you need. So it's time for you to take action. It's time for you to move forward in the direction that you know you are being called to move in because you have many, many people that are waiting on you and your gift. And the longer that you are sitting there not moving, not only are you doing a disservice to yourself, but you are also doing a disservice to the other people that are waiting on you you to move in their life because that is what you are meant to do. Um, I'm hearing that some of you guys are hairdressers. I'm hearing that some of you guys are tarot readers. I'm also hearing that some of you guys want to sell cars or are car salesmen. Um, and Spirit is saying, what are you doing? It's time for you to move. I don't want to necessarily sound repetitive, but I keep saying, what are you doing? Because what are you doing? If you're not moving towards your your purpose and the goals that you know that you need to be moving towards, what is it that you are doing? Are you being lazy? Are you making excuses? Are you just staying stuck? Are you choosing not to see the path in front of you even though you see the path in front of you? What is it that you are doing right now, this very moment, literally, 
this very moment i know you're watching this video in this very moment but outside of that what is what does your day-to-day -day look like are you acting like you are doing something and you really aren't are you lying to yourself telling yourself hey i'm moving around i'm doing what i'm supposed to be doing but in actuality you're not doing anything if this video is resonating with you spirit is telling you it's time to take action believe in yourself it is time that you believe in yourself it is time that you believe in your spiritual gifts because i believe i am talking more to the spiritual uh, collective that know that they have a gift that knows that they have a power that will be very instrumental to other people in this world and you are sitting on it you need to take action now i don't care how big or how small it is you need to take action now i'm hearing that many of you guys have been beating yourself up and spirit is saying stop beating yourself up they are with you they are guiding you you need to trust this process and i feel you guys want to take a huge big leap and spirit is saying it's going to take many small steps to get you to where you want to be you want the end result now and spirit is saying the end result is not going to be right now you have to work and move towards that end result so you can see that end result um, you have to go through the process and you have to trust the process. So what is it that you are going to start doing right now? What actions are you going to take? What goals are you going to set? Are you going to meditate? Are you going to ask spirit how you... Uh, how you should move forward. Are you going to ask spirit what exact actions you should take? What are you doing that is helping you to propel in your purpose? It is time to propel in your purpose and move forward in your purpose and not stay stuck. See, many of you guys have a belief in self problem and trust me, I know because I had the same issue, which is why I am able to create this video. I wasn't believing in myself. I wasn't trusting in myself. I didn't think that I had everything that I needed to be able to move forward and even put out a video like this. Even right now, I am trusting the process and trusting even if one person watches this video, it is meant for that one purpose or for that one person to fulfill their purpose. So I have to put this video this video out even for that one purpose. Move even if you're scared. You have to work through your fears to get to where you want to be in life. Everything that you want is on the other side of fear. So are you going to start believing in yourself? Are you going to stop being afraid? And are you going to just take the necessary action? Stop beating yourself up and do what it is you have to do to move forward in your purpose. That is where your manifestations lie. That is where your prosperity and your wealth lies. That is where the love lies. That is where the peace lies. That is where everything that that you desire uh, resides at, at this moment in your life, but you're not moving towards it because you are afraid. We are in 2021 and it's time for you to pick up your feet and it is time for you to t uh, put one foot in front of the other and take the, nex the necessary actions to move forward with your purpose and with your dreams and trust and know that you are divinely guided and supported in the direction that you are meant to go okay all right that is your motivational monday message again this is something new this is all freestyle i am pretty much going off the messages that i receive um to share with you so and just being personal with you guys this is challenging for me as well because i have to trust the information and the messages that are coming to me to share with you on the fly this was all impromptu, <laughs> but again, I know this is part of my purpose and part of what I am supposed to be doing to help you as a spiritual teacher, as a spiritual healer, as an intuitive reader, as a motivational speaker, and all the other roles that I play in this world and on this planet earth while I am here. So I am also being that example and being a leader 
and doing what I need to do, hoping that it will inspire you, knowing and believing that it will inspire you because I'm not just doing this for any reason. And your purpose and the actions that you take, you're not just doing that for any reason either. It will help somebody. It may not be the masses at first like you may believe it will be, but it will grow into that because it takes the small steps and one step at a time. And once you take each small step at a time, you'll realize, dang, okay, I'm at the top. I climbed that mountain. I climbed that staircase. And then before you know it, you're at the victory and success that you wanted in the beginning. But you have to take the first step, even if you can't see the next step. That is faith, like Martin Luther King said, okay? All right, I hope this video finds you well. And until next Motivational Monday, love, peace, and Virgo vibes.